Tonight, first responders are working around the clock, making sure that they're ready to keep you and your family safe. No matter how much snow falls, News 3 anchor Zach Dahlheimer live for us in Virginia Beach, where fire crews have been preparing. And Zach, we can see that you have a great perspective of what we should be looking into later this week. Yes, indeed, Kerr. I want to tell you the truck that I'm standing on here in Virginia Beach Fire Department, as well as the two trucks surrounding me, I'm told that these are the three busiest fire trucks in all the city of Virginia Beach. And starting tomorrow night, Kurt, you can expect to see more firefighters on trucks like this as they prepare and get ready for the snow expected. Now, they also tell me that firefighters here in Virginia Beach and other first responders are ready to respond to any call even as they work through challenges related to COVID. 911 may be the three digit number on fire trucks in Virginia Beach, but with snow projected this week, the number on firefighters' minds is 100. We are 100% ready to go. Ready for any call with trucks full of fuel, ice melt, and extra firefighters. We'll have additional smaller vehicles staffed so that we can handle any increased call volume. If there is an emergency, we will be coming out to you. We may be a little bit slower than normal, obviously. You also will have more firefighters on trucks like this. Yes, so we'll have more firefighters staffing starting tomorrow evening and then throughout the weekend. Most of our, our trucks will have three person staffing. We'll upstaff to four people per truck. That extra person makes a huge amount of difference in time for when we look at the amount of time it takes to get lines pulled, water on the fire, fire out rescue situations. And certainly we want our people to be cautious and we want citizens to be safe. Meanwhile, Chesapeake police will be staging officers at fire and police stations throughout the city, hoping to drive down delays on calls. Chief Kelvin Wright says they're also stocked with all wheel drive and high elevated vehicles ready for the snow. Wright's message to you, please stay off the roads once the snow hits the ground. Don't be going out and just enjoying the snow, because all you're going to do is probably get involved in an accident, and that takes up police resources that can't be devoted to do other things that take place at that same time. A lot of our time is tied up with uh, drivers who find themselves either snowbound or in accidents. And a lot of times, if the traffic is very bad, it makes it very difficult for us to get to the scenes where the accidents with injuries are and to clear the roads. For Trent, she says while COVID has created staffing concerns, they'll be ready and staffed for anything Mother Nature brings. We've got great personnel and they know that during these critical times where we have a need of and shortages, they will step up and they will work overtime um, so that we can maintain that service. Now, another important thing to know, Kurt, that Trent tells me that because the city of Virginia Beach does not plow residential neighborhood streets, they're asking you to please make sure you clear your porches, driveways, and walkways around your homes so that they can get to you if needed. Live on top of Ladder 7 here in Virginia Beach, Zach Dahlheimer, News 3.